everybody this is Ryan and uh, thanks for checking out this video this is a video uh, tutorial lesson a miniature version for Still Fallen by Hunter Hayes a lot of people have asked how to play this song I've got a cover available I'll put a link in the description but um, what I'm gonna do I'm gonna go through and just go over the chords for the verse the chorus and then the bridge and hopefully uh, you get something out of this and I'll try to get a more detailed video here in the near future with uh, more close-ups on my right hand, which I didn't do on this video. Uh, I'm doing. Uh, I'm just gonna put a video, uh, the camera up on the neck, so you can at least see the chords, and uh, you can kind of play around with that until I get a video of the finger, uh, the right hand. And honestly, I don't do it just like the record. I don't do it. Um, I believe I've kind of made up my own version, um, but the point is you, there's a few accent notes that you want to hit and uh, as long as you do that I think you'll be fine so thanks for checking out the video please at the end uh, give a thumbs up subscribe share comment let me know what you think and if there are any other videos um, tutorials on future songs that maybe I've covered or there's some that you want to to uh, learn let me know all right thanks enjoy the video all right guys um, I'm just going to go through the intro here first. I'm not going to get too in-depth with this, but I will try to make a more in-depth video uh, in the near future. But for this video, I just want to uh, allow everybody to see the chords and uh, the shapes they're played in. And uh, just work, in the meantime, work your own way around that. But we'll show the chords. So for the, uh, the intro, you're playing this A shape. It's in uh, capo 2, so it's in the key of B. But... So the accent there is and then as it goes to the uh, F sharp I use the thumb over the top right here so it goes and the next chord would be the D And you're basically accenting the same note from each chord change, from the A to the F sharp minor to the D. And then back to the A. So the so the uh, intro is A, F sharp, D, and A. And then once it goes into the verse, it starts on that A again. B minor 7 uh, don't ask what I just did there but I'm just playing the A so anyway you would think for all the days I've known you that I would have you memorized by now with every question every question answered and every single page turn you just keep me on the edge somehow so sorry for that mess up but in the verse there you're going A you would think for all the days I've known you B minor 7 I would have you memorized by now the D with every question answered and every single page turn you just keep me on back to the A yet somehow E and that's key on there if you want to make it sound really good is to hit that E the hammer on your hand it's like an E suspended so you're hammering on from the first fret on the G string to the second fret on the G string which goes it's a G sharp to A hammer on and you can also do it like this um, hammering that you're, you're sliding over the same note you're just changing the rest of the fingering so uh, all the verse is pretty much like that um, sorry for the baby in the background 
And then when it goes to the chorus, after all this time you think I'd be. So it's D A E. Used to the pull of your gravity. And then the change up here um, is on this part after. So you're going to B minor 7. is like uh, A with a C sharp, uh, but we're gonna leave the B and E uh, high B and E strings, um, these two, open. And then you go to the D. Back the E. Just go, uh, goes back and forth where you're, they're holding the A and then you go back into the verse. So that's your verse and chorus. Um, there's like an instrumental bridge thing and it just basically is like a... So anyway, the the bridge is just walking up that chord shape, going walking up, walking down, walking up, walking down, from the B minor, the C sharp with the A, or the A with the C sharp, to the D, to the C sharp, to the uh, minor seven. So hopefully that helps. Um, I'm gonna try to get out a, a more detailed video in the near future, but for those wanting to know, there you go.